Good morning, students. Welcome back. How are you all? I think you are you are not understanding what ma'am is teaching because many students of uh, standard they are not completing homework. Again and again, I am telling you now. I have started giving you homework on WhatsApp because I took experience of one week. From one week, I am just observing that you are completing homework of math, you are completing homework of English, you are completing homework of Marathi. But I am not seeing students completing homework of English. Either you don't understand or you understand but you don't like to do homework of English. I don't know why because my classes are not that boring. My classes are quite interesting. I want each and everyone completing English homework. Because once the school will start, we are not going to take your this lessons again. Okay, whatever we are, we are teaching you on group, on video, that only homework you have to complete. Every day you, you have to complete your homework in time. So that it will not make you, it will not be hectic for you. Are you understanding or It will not be hectic for you that if your school starts in July or August and then you come, you start coming in school and nothing is written in English notebook. Then teachers will scold you, huh? keep in mind. And uh, our teachers are teaching, our teachers are teaching, our teachers are, they are, no, they are checking your homework. But many students, they are not completing English homework. I want everyone to complete your English homework. Yesterday, as I told you, you have to do, you have, uh, uh, you have to complete homework of the alphabetical order. Six points were there. That six points you have to write down in your in your notebook. I know if you don't have your grammar book, you can stop my video. You can zoom the video and write down from both. Many students are completing homework in same way, even if they don't have book. Why you need book? You don't need any book because. We are there here and we are writing everything on board. You can see everything. Now there is quite clear and my handwriting is quite clear. You can see my board properly. So I want everyone to complete your homework and we are going to start with new lesson. The name of our lesson is the vowels and consonants. Okay, the vowels, the vowels and consonants. Now what is this consonants and vowels? Ma'am, this we have not studied in uh, LKG, UKG. Yes, we are studied in UKG. At least vowel. Correct or not? Dange ma'am and uh, Shiroi ma'am has taught you about vowels. Correct? There are five vowels. What are those five vowels? What are consonants? That all we are going to study in today's English period. So here it is shown that English alphabet has how many letters from last three, four periods? I am telling you again and again. English alphabet has how many letters? There are 26 letters in English alphabet. How many letters are there? 26 letters are there in English alphabet. Now, which are those 26 letters? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, H, E, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. These all are how much? 26. How many are there there? 26 are there. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Twenty six letters are there, and this from this twenty six letters, five out of them are vowels. Five out of them are what? They are vowels. Now, which are vowels? A, E, I, O, U. Okay. This is in alphabetical order, yes or no? A after A which will come, which letter will come? E will come after E which will come, I will come, O will come, then last one U will come. You you could not say why Mama has written A first? Why U is not first? You can ask him such question. Why U, U is written back at last only? Because it is U in alphabetical order is last. Correct. A in alphabetical order is first. The E in alphabetical order is second. Now, B, E is not second, but B is second. But B is vowel or what? No. How many vowels are there? There are five vowels. A, A, E, I, O, U. How many vowels are there? There are five vowels. Which are those? A, E, I, O, U. Come on, repeat again. A, E, I, O, U. Now, don't be get confused. Asa na kamanu ki baba. Capital A ka small A, both A's. Okay? Capital A, small A, capital E, small E, capital I, small I, capital O, small O, capital U, small U. Okay? These all five are what? They are vowels. They are vowels in alphabet. Then, 
if i will give you if i will tell you to i will give you some examples and I, if i will tell you to underline vowels in this word you will able to underline i think yes you will be able to underline here it is given here it is given fill in the blanks just fill in the blanks we will do afterwards and if i will tell you to underline some vowels in the word you should able to underline if i will give you some words like for example net n e t net now which word is vowel in this which letter is vowel in this word i think e not think it is correct e is what e is vowel if i will give you another word rainbow for example rainbow okay now in this word how many vowels are there can you tell me how many vowels are there in this letter in this word there are three vowels now you will say oh, anything ma'am is showing anything how it can be three vowels there only one vowel is there then how three vowels will be there in this word there can be as many as vowels in the word now your a is vowel right i is vowel correct and o is vowel so in this word how many vowels are there three vowels are there how many vowels are there three if i will tell you another word for example if i will tell you another example chair c h a i r chair now in this word how many vowels are there you will say ma'am only one no there are five vowels and this five vowels can come in any word as many as they can come are you understanding kiti pan vowels asu shaktat eka shabda madhe and total vowels kiti hai paanch how many vowels are there five vowels are there So then in chair, how many vowels are there? Two are there. A is there and I is there. Two vowels are there. Chair. Correct. If I will tell you some another word, uh, for example, if I will tell you pencil. P E N C I L. Pencil. Now in this word, how many vowels are there? There are two vowels in this word. E is there and I is there. Now you have to by heart part of Karachi. So my teacher will turn up. If a teacher will ask you, students, how many vowels are there in English alphabet? Then you should say, ma'am, there are five vowels in English alphabet. If teacher will ask you which are those, then you should immediately start with A, E, I, O, U. Again, A, E, I, O, U. Again, A, E, I, O, U. Understood? A E I O U A E I O U are five vowels. Now here some fill in the blanks. Now here some vowels are not given in the spellings, and we are going to add those vowels in the spelling. Now first picture is of cow, correct? The first picture is of cow. Then if you want to write vowel, if you want to add or if you want to fill in the blank, so Well, which letter will come in this word? A C dash W. Which letter will come from this vowel? I think O will come. Yes. Then what word it will become? It will become C O W cow. What it will become? C O W cow. Next one is ball. Next picture which is given over here is of ball. Then B dash L L. If you want to add vowel in this word, which vowel will come? You know very well spelling of ball. You, if I ask you what is spelling of ball, then you will say B A L L. Then A is what? A is vowel. Correct. Third word which I will give you is girl. Third picture is of girl. So then G dash R L girl. So which vowel will come in this word? i vowel will come which vowel will come i next one is knife k y dash f dash two vowels you have to add here so you should know first you should know spelling of knife knife means what suri yes or no you can even call it uh, saku saku yes or no so what is spelling of knife k y n i f e knife Next word which is given over here is a picture which is given over here is of pencil. After pencil is aeroplane. 
Now same thing. C dash N C dash L. Now two vowels we have to add here R, E and I. Same scene. Next example is aeroplane. A dash R dash C L A A is there, okay? So dash I have spoken and E and E. E is also vowel. Now C in this word how many vowels are there? We have one vowel. One, two, three, four. So we have to put how many uh, vowels? We have to put four vowels in this word. So A E R O A E. So it becomes aeroplane. What it becomes? Aeroplane. Next one is seventh example is given of dash M D R dash L L dash. So what is this picture? This picture is of what? This picture is of umbrella. Correct or not? So umbrella, umbrella means what in Marathi? Chatri. Aeroplane means what? You know aeroplane. Pencil means pencil. Knife means what? Suri. Girl means what? Mulgi. Ball means ball only. Cow means what? Guy. So umbrella. Now which, which vowels will come over here? Here U will come. Are you getting? And here E will come and here A will come. So that word will become umbrella. Umbrella which we use in rainy season. Correct. Next one is picture of a fruit. Which is this fruit? And next one is animal. So what is this fruit? That fruit is orange. So dash R dash N G dash. So here which of our letters will come? O will come here, A will come here and E will come over here. So what word it will become? It will become orange. And the last example which is given over here is the last example which is given over here is elephant. Dash L dash T H dash N T. So which letters will come over here? Your E will come. E L E T H A. So we have completed how many examples of fill in the blanks? We have completed nine examples of fill in the blank. You have to fill what? What we have done filling in this word? We have done filling of vowels. And kitty vowels are sir. First of past vowels are sir. Kitty vowels are sir. Past. Which are those? A E I O U. Have you understood? Consonants we will study in next period. But keep in mind, in English alphabet, how many vowels are there? If I will ask you how many vowels are there, you should be able to tell me, ma'am, there are five vowels in English alphabet. And if I will ask you again, which are those, then you should be able to tell me, ma'am, A E I O U are vowels. Five vowels are there. Total there are 26 letters. In 26 letters, 5 vowels are there and remaining from 26, 5, 5 gone. Correct? If I will do 26 minus 5. Correct? 6 minus 5, 1. And this 2 will come as it is down. Then where 21 letters went? These 21 letters are consonants. 21 letters are what? Consonants. The remaining letters of the alphabet are consonants. What they are? They are consonants. So, how many vowels are there? There are 5 vowels. And there are 21 consonants. There are 21 consonants. And this 21 consonants we will study in next period. But before that I would like to tell all 21 consonants. Which are those? Here it is given. B, B, C, D, F, G, H, I is not there. I is what vowel? So J, K, L, M, N, O is what? O is vowel. So O is not there. Then P, Q, R, S, T. Now U is what? U is vowel. So U is not given here. V, W, X, Y, Z. These all are consonants. What are they? They are consonants. 
What is your homework today? You are going to write down. You are going to write down this name of the lesson, the vowels and consonants. On new page, you are going to write down English alphabet, twenty-six letters. Our five out of them are vowels, and which are those? A E I O U. And then you have to write down your questions. Fill in the blanks. I will send you photo of this. I will send you photo of these pictures, and you have to fill. Fill in the blanks with what? You have to fill in the blanks with the vowels and nine examples you have to do in today's homework. Okay? We have studied today of vowels, consonants. We will study tomorrow. I have given you little bit idea of consonants, but in detail I will explain you consonants in tomorrow's period. Okay? Thank you.